why you say time changes things, but you actually have to change them yourself. Andy Warhol. The people of the mist didn't have to change because they didn't want to, so they never did. Welcome back to the CB Podcast. Today we're talking about the book City of the Beast by Isabel Lenda. So we've read over this thesis of, in the novel City of the Beast by Isabel Lenda, the values of the people of the mist help them sustain life. It demonstrates that humans are uncomfortable with change, but sometimes it is good. Alex and Nadia changed to get the Indians' trust. The people of the mist lived old-fashioned and did everything the same for, the dec- for decades. LeBlanc said they acted like savages and were ruthless killers, but they are the opposite. Alex and Nadia wanted to gain the trust of the people of the mist, and they could see them, them wearing clothes scare them. So they took their clothes off and painted themselves to make the people of the mist feel safe and secure. Alex and Nadia didn't like the food they were they were offered, but the people of the mist took offense to them not eating the food they offered. So Alex and Nadia ate it anyways, anyways to not offend them. Alex had to do tests to gain the trust of the people of the mist so that he could become chief to them. This relates back to the thesis because Alex was very uncomfortable with the test, but he, he knew he had to do it to become a chief for the people of the mist and gain their trust. Yeah, this one says that the people of the mist didn't use guns and bullets. Instead, they used old-fashioned weapons like bows and arrows and spares. They didn't start fires with lighters and things like that. They went old-fashioned and used things like nature to start a fire, including rocks and sticks. Also, they didn't even wear clothes, but instead painted themselves because they didn't know how to make clothes. So in the end, the people of the mist still use old-fashioned weapons and traditions to maintain their culture. For this one, it says they only killed when they needed food and they felt in danger, which is not savage at all. Also, if the people of the mist were like LeBlanc said, they would have killed Alex and Nadia instead of taking them and showing them their lives. If they were actual savages and ruthless murderers, they wouldn't care about giving a proper funeral to anybody they killed or anything. This has to do with the, the thesis because the people of the mist are nothing like LeBlanc said, and they have been really respectful and spiritual for decades. Finally, the people of the mist have lived so many years because their culture and traditions They carry them and keep them alive. Here's the bibliography followed by the credits. Thanks for tuning in to CB Podcasts. And we are out.